What is up, homies? Welcome back to another reaction from Heroes Reforged. Tonight, we are reacting to Marvel Studios, a special presentation of Werewolf by Night, directed by composer Michael Giacchino. If you guys want to see the uncut reaction for this, though, go to our Patreon, patreon.com slash Heroes Reforged. Plenty of stuff this month for spooky season. Might be a couple surprises, too. You never know. You should go check it out. Highly recommend. Also, we are getting closer and closer to 100,000 subscribers. Keep it up, baby. This trailer blew my mind, dude. This Yo, was this such a amazing. This was such yeah. a under the radar project, and I knew it was coming, and I knew it was coming, and it was Michael Giacchino, and I knew it was coming, and Gael Garcia was going to be the lead, and nobody was there's, there was nothing, nobody was talking about it, and then this trailer came out, and it was like this shot to the top of my most anticipated thing. Period. I, I feel yeah. like I'm, I I still might be like Black Panther, Wakanda Forever is my number one most anticipated, and then Werewolf by Night, and then everything yeah. else. <laughs> I'm in a similar boat as you because. The idea of Michael Giacchino directing something in the MCU is really, really cool. He has directed a few things before. This is not his directorial debut, but it is it is his directorial debut in the MCU. And when Kevin Feige asked him, when they got the conversation started, you know, Kevin Feige just straight up asked him, what would you want to do? And he said, Werewolf by Night. And Feige was like, what? Where, Werewolf huh? by Night? What is I it? think it's, I think it's such a perfect way to start introducing this part of the MCU. We know yeah. Blade's coming. We know there might be potential other more horror-centric characters coming. So I'm so Moon excited Knight. to see Moon Knight. Exactly. We just had Moon Knight. Yeah. So I'm really excited to continue exploring this corner of the MCU. And I'm mm -hmm. so excited to have Michael Giacchino directing this and composing the score. I, I, I'm That trailer, you, like you said, it was amazing. So I cannot wait. Yeah. Ready? All right. Calm us down, buddy. All right. Here we go. In three, two, one, go. Oh, I'm in. Super groovy. I love the bongos. A Marvel Studios special presentation. Oh, interesting. Both logos. Okay. Yeah. Oh, I knew it. I knew it. <laughs> Yo! Yes! yes! <laughs> wow. wow. This music. Wow. I'm going to need this full oh, time. So cool. Full time. Uh, 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 uh. Oh my god, this might oh, be the wow. best version of it ever. <laughs> oh, I love it. I feel like this is making Adam's heart so happy. <laughs> I think I just twisted my pants. <laughs> this is so good. Oh my god. I love that it has that slight jitter. In our modern world, this is where monsters dwell. Like those who hunt and slaughter them with pride. None more prolific than the Bloodstone family. Yes. Paint the Bloodstone, a weapon unlike any other. Ulysses Bloodstone. This mm. weapon is in want of a new master, for Ulysses Bloodstone has died. This, this, I could tell this special is going to be full of so many like Marvel Easter eggs. Yeah, little Easter eggs. Who will wield the bloodstone? Nice. Oh, Gael. Nice. Ooh, it's in color. The bloodstone, I'm assuming. I like That's that. cool. 57 confirmed kills myself. <laughs> I can almost smell the blood in your hands. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Any of these Hackett beasties, your handiwork. No. no but Whoa. But him, him I fought a few times. Mm. He's mm. never looked so alive. <laughs> that was actor Kirk Thatcher. He's also a director. He's directed tons mm. of stuff and stuff for the Muppets. He also just recently mm. directed Muppets Haunted Mansion. Mm. You were so promising growing up. We all believed you would surpass your father. Mm, there it is. Instead, you seem satisfied to emulate your mother. I did what I could with you. Shame I didn't turn out. Don't be too easy on yourself. You were the greatest disappointment of his life. <laughs> mm hmm Damn. Okay. Harsh. Harsh. An impressive 57 and over 100 deaths. Give or take. Over 100? Wow. He was a leader, a friend, 
love uh, without equal. <laughs> okay. <laughs> <laughs> What is going on? Opening it up. Is that really? Okay. Ooh, wow. Ooh, good Lord. That's creepy. I do hope my attendance Whoa, you. What? This honor can only be bestowed upon the strongest and most committed to our mission. I think all these guys are going to die. <laughs> the hunter so. who slays this beast will become our new leader, taking possession of my bloodstone. Like Hunger Games. Yeah. <laughs> uh, is that going to be me when I'm dead? Probably. Yeah. It'll be all three of us on YouTube like this. Yeah. <laughs> the only weapons permitted tonight have been placed throughout the garden for you to find. Stone will be affixed to the monster's hide. Oh. These people are so dramatic. Yeah. But why is Gael so scared? He seems very uneasy about all this. But she gets to crash this thing like it's a backyard wedding. It brings up a good point, huh? Where's the lovely lady's medallion? Have you checked up your own arms? Elsa is welcome. <laughs> <laughs> She's fair game. No special treatment. Okay. Straight up Hunger Games. We'll be honored. TVA agents? No? Yeah? Did we just see them? That's what I that's what I thought from the trailer. It is every hunter for themselves. This guy's giving me blade vibes for sure. Yeah. Hey, you lucky bastard. You shall go first. <laughs> I'm about to see a monster. I like this a lot. Off you go. Oof. And good luck. God damn. I love the use of lighting in this. Mm hmm. It's really good. Yeah, see, like, those look like TV agents. Although I don't know their uniform out from memory. Whoa, it's a labyrinth. Whoa. Ooh, was that it back there? Oh, that God. was it back there. Oh, wow. <laughs> this is so fucking cool, you guys. Like a werewolf by night maze. That would be cool. Love that classic lighting. Very nice. Very nice classic. He did like all the all the classic lighting tricks in one shot. I suggest we just pass each other by. <laughs> what? Just keep going. He said, I suggest I... we just pass each other by. <laughs> oh, oh. Ooh. Ooh. oh my gosh. Oh, homeboy's just going for Oh! Wow. Okay. She must have some kind of invulnerability. Yeah. You're gonna jump. Uh oh. Thought she was gonna jump toward him and cut his head off. Mm -hmm. Oh, this guy's going first. Holy God. <laughs> no, steamy blood. Get out of there. Get out of there. Steamy Bigfoot blood. Oh, damn. Oh, man. Homeboy's getting his arm cut off. Yup. There it is. Sid. Called it. Called it. Yeah. Okay. Oh, my God. <laughs> oh, she's going to take his weapon. Oh, no. oh. <laughs> through the through the chin in the through mouth the gullet. Yo, oh yo. lord! Yo. This is everything I've wanted from the MCU. <laughs> I mean, it's the same reason why Tarantino did the whole uh, sword fight in black and white. Yeah. Sass. Yeah. 
Not very, uh, not very observant. Gimli, Gimli got his axe back. Okay. <laughs> yeah. Oh, okay. Yo, that's gruesome. I love it. Can you grab? Okay, yeah. Hey, oh. <laughs> <laughs> hey, buddy. Well, of course I was gonna come find you. He's trying to rescue him. Well, you keep saying that you're gonna be careful each time, and here we go again. You can't keep counting on me to save you. This is the last time. That's amazing. Oh my god, the sympathetic monster, of course! It's weak to you, right? Frankenstein's monster. Yeah, they said that the stone would do that. Don't worry, I have a plan. Oh. Look, these little things explode. So we're gonna explode our way out of here. All you have to do is don't die. Oh. Is that like an Agent Coulson shield bomb from Iron Man 1? I don't I don't know, is it? I'll find you, I don't Looks know. Like it. Oh! Damn it. Vampire Michael Jackson hurt it all. <laughs> You're hurt? Can I help you? No. Okay. Don't touch. <laughs> mm-hmm. Not touchy. I have to say I'm having a hard time believing you hunted and killed monsters. Well, I'm not that type of hunter. At least not like those Hasbiros out there. If you're not a hunter, why do you want the stone? He doesn't. He wants, he wants to save his monster friend. He wants the monster. That's not the reason why I'm here. You know, maybe we can help each other. If you help me get the monster out of here alive, I'll give you the stone. I can get you the stone. Right, yeah, because you just have a quick chat with him, sort it out, because you're what? The monster's friend. <laughs> <laughs> Why, yes, I am. <laughs> Indeed, I am, lady. And sometimes we think that by doing something very specific, we can change everything and not be like them. I DNA. like this. Dialogue. I like this scene. We could die here. <laughs> you and I with your family is an option. It's not my choice, but it's an option. <laughs> we could die. Oh, that's her whole family in there. Yeah. All of the bloodstones over the eras, over the, the past, the, the yeah. Generations, yeah. What are you doing? When I was a kid, my dad used to tell me stories about my crazy Aunt Frances. Uh. Those are spiders. So let's get her out and party. He said that if I misbehaved, she would unlock her tomb and come out and pull me back in there with her for company. <laughs> oh my god. She's just pulling out. That when she did, okay, she put her together. <laughs> Avengers assemble. Oh. oh. When did she pull out? And he's an exit okay. strategy. That's, That's great. That's fun. That is like so that. funny. I'm trusting you, okay? Just get me the stone, we're good. Then you're on your own. <laughs> oh my God. She's still <laughs> resourceful. I like it. Need a weapon. I like it. When you run into him, just, just treat him like an old friend. <laughs> Call him by his name. Which is? Ted. He's called Ted. Ted. He is called Ted. <laughs> Ted is his real name. Ted. Tom, because I, I've been great. Oh, shit. No. Bro. I'm surprised this Kirk Thatcher character lived this long. I thought he would be the first to go. Yeah, I thought he'd be out. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> That's so cool. <laughs> Ted? <laughs> you have a lovely name. <laughs> God. Your friend is waiting for you. <laughs> that thing still hasn't blown up? I'm no, shocked. apparently not. Them running in opposite directions. We just followed what Elsa was doing, and now we've gone back yeah. a few moments. This is what was happening while Elsa was. 
It didn't stick. Oh my sweet <laughs> Christ. Place it. There's a crack. You just place it and run. It's getting faster. No, nope. behind find you. It. Come on. Hurry up. He can't find it. Oh my sweet lord. Uh, it's just yeah, just literally, literally. Crack. Okay. okay, there you go. Oh my no. god. Just, just seed it in there. Ugh. There you there go. You go. There, there you go. You go. Oof. Blade's brother, I mean. Okay, go, go, go. There you go. Go, 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 go. Run, run, Unlimited run, run. power. There you go. You got it, boo boo. Amazing. Bye, man thing. Later, man thing. Hi, Ted. Hi, Ted. <laughs> Hi, Ted. Ted. See you later, Ted. Ted. Salas, I believe it's his name. Oh, okay. That's not oh, good. No. Oh, is this uh -oh. what causes him to transform? Well, now. Look at this. Definitely not TVA agents. The Bloodstone okay. did this to you. Oh. <laughs> he grabbed it. And it threw him back. My word. <laughs> how the, how the thick is plot. A monster. Masquerading as one of our own. And that's how they oh. learned that, that Jack is a monster. I can't wait to find out what breed of evil you are. Oi, oi, oi. It wasn't safe. Oh, wait, did you think it might cloud my judgment a bit? I know. I'm an idiot, I know. <laughs> but I'm also a human. Perhaps not in the category that you would call a human a human. <laughs> Amazing. <laughs> I need you to look at me, okay? Do not break eye contact, no matter what. What are you talking about? What are you doing? <laughs> so he, so he remembers who she is when he transforms. Oh, I see. I need to remember you. Well, does it work? Smell good, Chanel. Once. Oh, oh, man. oh man. This, this oh, character God. is so heartbreaking. I love yeah. him. <laughs> That's terrible. Nice. Pretty cool. Pretty cool. It's time for you to show yourself. Oh, Lord. Tightening up my headphones for this one. <laughs> Oh God! The one Not tier. the one tier. That one Not the tier. one tier. Oh, it's so good. Oh God! Oh man! Oh God! No! Oh wow! Now, this is some comic booky shit. I love it. Yep. I love how this this whole thing looks like it's ripped straight out of like. The yeah, Wolfman look at that, or look Universal. At the look at yeah. the background. Look at that. That looks like it's animated. That looks like it's hand animated. Oh, yeah, baby. Oh, wow. <laughs> That's what's up. That's so dope. Oh, you just know Jack's going to kill all these people. <laughs> yeah. They all did. Yep. Oh, oh. There goes your arm. The good three. <laughs> oh wow. Shoot her. Shoot her. <laughs> oh man, this reveal is gonna be good. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> You. <laughs> there he is. On now. Yeah. On now. Oh. Yo, oh. That, oh, wow. <laughs> that looks amazing. It's so cool. It looks so cool. Let's look at the shot expanding. Oh, oh my God. Oh. oh, I wish this wasn't 3D. It's a good thing I'm sitting down right now. Oh. <laughs> wow. <laughs> Jack. Yeah, baby. Yeah, he looks great. Yeah. 
Orejón. Oh, she okay, she's out. out. Run, lady. Run, 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 run. Oh, no, nope, sorry. He didn't sorry, make it very long. He ain't gonna be a blade three. <laughs> nope. Yes. <laughs> it's the hallway fight. It's the hallway fight. <laughs> yes. Oh, I love it. Oh, it's closing slowly, slowly. Oh, uh, I want this to be a 3D ride at some park, damn it. That look at the cameras just getting more and more covered with blood. That's We'd awesome. love to see it. Oh, no. X-Men confirmed, guys. X-Men confirmed. <laughs> Oh, oh. oh, dang. It's so great. I feel like I've read old Marvel comics like this where like some cult person is using a gem and they're fighting with oh, energy. Oh, and... oh, 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 oh. One in the throat, they want to And then face. somebody gets stabbed in the head right there. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, too sweet. The Holy Grappler. Whoa. Oh my god. Dang. Oh, oh right got, her. got her. Got oh, her. Sorry, stepmom. I think Elsa's going to get the bloodstone and she's going to like embed it into herself because I feel like that's what the bloodstone does is whoever is like the, like it's embedded into their chest and then they're powered by it oh, and they okay. live long and they have enhanced strength and senses. Yeah. Look him in the eyes. Elsa, look she's him in the eyes. He's about to pull a hey, hey, big guy. Sun's getting yeah. real low. Sun's getting real low, Jack. Don't <laughs> <laughs> play hide the zucchini. <laughs> no, Adam. <laughs> What's wrong with Wolfie? The foster parents are dead. Jack, you still in there? I mean, barely. I want to see a close up of this makeup. It looks so good. It's really cool. Oh, oh no. no. Oh, oh wow. Cool. So dope. Cool. <laughs> Is that a different actor? I think it might be. No, it actually. He's a dad who's got some nose prosthetics on. Yeah, or it's like they really. Sure. It worked. It did work. I shipped them. I hope they yeah, will fall in love. The monster hunter and the monster, that'd be perfect. Come on. Yeah. <laughs> you will now die as you lived. A disgrace to your father's memory. You kill her. Oh. And the that bloodstone. bloodstone Yo! <laughs> yes, who's back? <laughs> You're about back to get again. melted, lady. Oh my yeah. god. Yeah. Damn. Yes. <laughs> How's it going? Want we'll get beer? Thanks, Ted. What? what? He went that way. <laughs> All right, thanks. See you later. Hey, good luck with this place. I, I only wanted to make myself available to you. <laughs> Brilliant, you can stop clearing all this shit up. <laughs> yep. Now she's, in the house. Now, she's, now she's the bloodstone. Yeah, that's right. Yep. I'm gonna I'm chill out right here. I'm gonna have me a cocktail. Queen of the castle. Oh, oh okay. Wow. Nice. Wow. That's awesome. That's oh, no way. That's so cool. There's a cup of coffee for you. Oh, thanks, Ted. Papa Joe. <laughs> I like him. <laughs> yeah. Is she okay? Oh. Good. That's good. <laughs> oh, 
<laughs> now, I'm the one who comes to your rescue. What are you talking about? Whatever, no. <laughs> <laughs> Wow. That was no fun. No way. Don't tell me this is it. Oh, That's it? Man. Damn, that did not feel like 52 minutes. Oh, Damn it to hell. That's perfect. Damn it to hell. Um, great, oh, great story. Man. Simple, but like great script, I think, really brought out the best in the actors and, and in the characters and stuff. That was fun. Uh, so, okay, guys. So, Hector, we just saw it. This was one of your most anticipated projects. Initial yeah. thoughts, please. Please, please. I, I really, really liked it. I think that uh, that the trailer has more of a like a chaotic and quick pacedness yeah. to it, right? Like the trailer yeah. was more grindhouse and the yeah. actual special itself is more classic 1930s universal monsters yeah. thing. So mm -hmm. so that's mm -hmm. cool. You know, it's it's uh I haven't shown Abby the trailer yet because she okay. she doesn't like things spoiled so we're gonna watch this together and then i'm gonna show her the trailer after and see what she thinks about it but my initial impression was it was really well done it was super fun and a great 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 introduction to jack russell werewolf by night elsa bloodstone and ted salas man thing so i'm very mm -hmm, happy mm -hmm. i almost wish that they had been doing this type of thing earlier. Can you imagine if I we know. got like shorter introductions to characters and just got, I, know. I don't know if there's anything I need to know more between the relationship of man thing and werewolf by night. And like, yeah. I'd like to see it expanded on, but I'm sold on their relationship. I'm sold that they're homies and I want to see more of it. And I think that's, that's what I'd like to see more and maybe how they introduce more characters at this point. Mm -hmm. I, mm -hmm. I love the I love the, the, the Disney Plus shows. Uh, that's that's doing really great with also setting the specific tones for what's happening. Yeah, but I think we've talked about this like a really long time ago where I wish they would do shorts for characters before the Marvel movies play, you know, mm -hmm. and this felt yeah, kind of totally, like totally. in those in the in that vein of like, oh, my God, here's a cool new short of an interaction between two characters it doesn't have to be a villain villain thing. It doesn't or a villain hero fight thing it could be these really cool character moments or interactions yes. or experiences that that these super well, like, powered people have i, I think really so many marvel i agree i think so many marvel characters i mean i remember marvel studios or other companies talking about oh the marvel universe has five thousand characters and i'm like yeah right. but like 50 of them are great like the rest of them yeah. are supporting <laughs> yeah. characters yeah. you know and i think that some characters uh like now everybody is really jonesing for like a scarlet witch solo movie mm -hmm. and i think we might get it even though she started mm -hmm. as a supporting character her and the vision or these kind of supporting avengers characters staple yeah. avengers characters in in the avenger stories but then pairing her with vision having their own story that they were the center of great it works scarlet witch on her own great it works you cut to characters like from the thor movies in the thor universe the warriors three i don't know if they could get their own movie or show but if they mm -hmm. had a Warrior 3 short that played before yeah. a Thor movie, mm -hmm. that's the exact type of character you use for that kind of thing, right? right? Where you're like, they're not super, they're not necessarily shallow, but they're not super deep characters. You can't do a bunch of great stuff with them, but you can do a really great, you know, short, simple, fun story to really mm -hmm. get the audience fall in love with characters. And it's yeah. especially great because they're going to keep popping up in other things later down the line. Like I think we're yeah. going to see with Werewolf by Night and Man Thing. So yeah. You're right. Yeah. It's perfect. Yeah. I think that's a good example, Hector, because they even say that in, um, I think it was Thor Love and Thunder, uh, where they were kind of going through who uh, Thor has lost. And then they go, and this guy, and that guy, and this guy. And it was the Warriors 3. And you're just like, well, yeah, nobody right. remembers the Warriors 3 because yeah. <laughs> you didn't spend enough time with them. But if you would have yeah. given right. them... Correct. of every mem of every memorable like eight to ten minutes short before a movie awesome and you totally awesome. remember who they are mm -hmm. right and then th whatever happens to them would have felt a little bit more you know had a little bit more of, of a of an emotional pull in whatever direction they're taking them yeah um, Absolutely. i think they really need to capitalize on this shorts idea though because this felt right it felt good adam are you impressed by jacchino's work are you impressed by all the camera stuff that he did and all the fake real changes and all this craziness that he did yeah i mean i definitely agree with hector i think the the trailer definitely felt like it had a little bit more grindhouse feel mixed with like 30s 40s monster movie cinema but then i feel like the this short still i mean it's an hour long so it's not exactly that short um mm -hmm. but i still feel like it, it delivers on all that 
honestly, and and I know that this might just be me. I kind of wish you would have went even harder on some of the, yeah. the <laughs> horror, the terror, and the scares. But yeah, that's yeah, yeah. that's kind of already putting it like to the borderline of just being a straight up horror film um, right, but that's just right. what i would really like but i i love it and i have been re-watching some of the stuff from the 30s dracula you know and some of those old classic films from the 30s and 40s and look wise it's definitely adapting that and i i love mm-hmm. that i think that's so cool you know like i was mentioning the halation on the lights the anamorphic lenses um the real changes all those like little details that kind of just lean it more towards that earlier era of film and i think Mm -hmm. it works incredibly well because jakina was saying you know this idea this concept was just kind of birthed out of what he remembers from watching monster movies with his brother Mm -hmm. and i would imagine that you know michael jakino is older than us i think he's in his early 50s now so you know you have to think that in the 70s, that's right around the era of when this like Ryan House style, the original monster movies are only 20, 30 years old up to that point. It's kind of like in the beginning era of cinema. So that is the stuff mm-hmm. that those kids would be watching at that time. So it makes total and sense that he would. because To go off what you're saying, Adam, especially mm-hmm. because in the 70s, that was like the decade for television coming into its own with oh now we are the home for reruns of classic stuff and showing classic movies right you know that that became such a like star trek even though it originated in the 60s for example it wasn't until the 70s through reruns that it Mm -hmm. got as popular as it did so Mm -hmm. you have all these Mm -hmm. classic monster movies getting shown on saturday nights you know and right right channels or whatever i'm positive that that is what you're describing is right that that's probably sure. what jakino grew up with watching with his brother yeah. so yeah. yeah yeah absolutely and i think i'm visually yeah it's it's all it's all there and i think even just from a story perspective yeah and they were doing those shorts for a while you know on the way to thor's hammer they did yeah, one, one for shot. yeah they, they, they the were doing those shots, one shots yeah. i loved those i thought those were so cool mm-hmm. i think it would be so fun instead of watching 45 minutes of freaking trailers to go in and watch like (laughs) a 20 minute short film about a character that's either a part of the movie you're about to watch or Mm -hmm. it's a character for some other upcoming thing like if it's not connected Mm -hmm. directly then like i'm fine with that but i think that like these types of things are one i think they're just really good creative opportunities where you can just do whatever you want and it's okay if it's unique and different it has its own style and flavor right two i think Mm -hmm. it's a really good way for marvel studios to bring in fresh talent uh, Michael Giacchino is yeah. not someone who's probably going to direct a feature anytime soon because he has such a busy scoring schedule. But mm-hmm. if you get, you know, more unknown horror directors or comedy, action, drama, whatever, to come in and do these little vignettes, basically, yeah. of characters yeah. or upcoming characters or events in the MCU. And even if they're not heroes, even if they're people who are like a supporting character of, a, of another major character. I think mm-hmm. there's so many opportunities to do stuff and to just really bring in new talent and just continue expanding outward the and the mcu beyond just the shows and the movies that tie into and build up to secret secret wars like this has yeah. nothing to do with any of that and i love it for yep. that i love the fact that it has this like standaloneness to it and i think mm-hmm. that aside, like in in addition to doing the shows and the movies that build to events i think it would be really nice to have the stuff that are these one-offs that people can come in and just if you love horror, here's something yeah. for you. If you love, you know, the holidays, here's the Christmas holiday special. I think there's just so much creative um, potentiality that I hope that they see the success of and they lean into it with this. I, I just, I'm glad the MCU is in a place where we can have something like this. Because I was yeah. asking for, I, I was asking for this when we were like doing stuff back in 2016, 2017, right? Mm. Uh, but now they're like in a place where the only thing to do now is change. And right. it, I, I, these, this kind of stuff is required so that we're not seeing the same MCU over and over again. Mm-hmm. And, and they're showing that they're picking a direction and they're going for it with all the Disney plus shows. I just want them to follow this lane, maybe make them shorter, mm-hmm. maybe make them a little bit more punchy. But other than that, I have no complaints and this was awesome. So really perfect for the spooky season, dude. This is a really oh, yeah, good yeah, little, yeah. cause yeah, you know, October's just starting. We just had the spooky season. Yeah. I just watched, uh, what I just watched? Hocus Pocus 2. It's just like, oh, yeah. it's just like easing me into the spookies. You know, yeah. we watched yeah, all yeah. the Halloween movies it's easing me into it and then later on in the month it's like you can get hit with some harder uh <laughs> yeah 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 well we're, we're about to go three or two right now. oh hector we are, we are. Pants on, dude. get excited my friend get excited but guys let us know in the comments below what you thought about werewolf by night would you like to see 
any other shorts like this or features like this, let us know what pockets of the Marvel universe would you like them to explore? What other genres should they explore? Let us know in the comments below what you thought. Subscribe if you haven't already. We'll see you in the next reaction. Bye.